Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of the Sky Guy Collectors. This is your boy Luis. Um, I'm going to be doing some unboxing videos, but before we get to that, I need a favor from you guys. Um, you guys have been so supportive. Um, I can't believe we've, we've been doing this for a year now. Um, but please, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification. Um, that way that you guys can, can be notified about any updating videos um definitely tune in we have a lot for you this coming year i'm excited <laughs> um yeah i'm excited i'm all thankful for chris and joe and i'm thankful for you guys thank you guys and continue to uh tell your grandmas to, su to, to subscribe to this channel um uh, but let's get right into it so today guys i am gonna be unboxing some things that i got um Clearly, I got. <laughs> I, I didn't steal it. No, I didn't steal it. Um, but yeah, let's go right into it. I am going to be unboxing today a Marvel's Legend figure. Going to be unboxing the Spider-Man No Way Home movie. If you haven't seen it, you got to watch it. Or you got to watch um, our review. Definitely watch our review. But today, I'm going to be going over Spider-Man No Way Home and we're going to be going to the black suit, the one that he got from Doctor Strange. Um, I'm going to go into it more. Um, but yeah, guys, check it out. Hope that you guys like it. Let's get this in the light box. So we got Spider-Man No Way Home, Marvel's Legends. I love the artwork on the side. Oh, look how beautiful. Black and gold. Black and yellow, black and yellow. Like I said, Spider-Man is part of the Build-A-Figure wave. Um, so there's all those that you can see. Doctor Strange, JJ, um, Shriek. I think, no, that's not Shriek. Uh, I think that's Morbius and stuff like that. Um, definitely want to add it to my collection. Again, there's the artwork. Um, and there's a leg from, to do, I think, Armadillo. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, we do got some some hands right there. Um, so it's nice to know that we can switch the hands out so we get different, I guess, poses. Um, but yeah, I'm going to let it spin for a while. So like, there you go. Spider-Man relies on this black and gold suit and the abilities to defend against threats. Again, if you've seen No Way Home... Doctor Strange gives him this black and yellow or black and gold suit to basically capture Doc Ock, Sandman, the Electro, um, Lizard, and the Green Goblin. Yeah, guys, let me open this and let, let's see how it looks. Okay, guys, so I got Spider-Man, the black suit uh, out. So, yeah, it's definitely right now. Does it look like Spider-Man? Yes, it does. Um, <clears throat> definitely looks like Spider-Man. I'm trying to see if the painting is off. The painting doesn't look too bad, um, to be honest with you. It does look like Spider-Man. Um, the only thing I don't remember, I don't remember if he had red here to be honest with you guys i thought it was all black right here in this area um oops i dropped him but because i remember he gets a wrist guard uh here from dr strange like a little like a little um had like powers and and stuff like that so maybe they should have added another accessory here to kind of kind of show the wrist guard here because it looks like it just looks incomplete compared to everything else like you can see the black and gold here and it just looks like it's just missing something um even the legs the legs you can tell that is black and gold here but the just the the wrist and everything just looks incomplete um i mean <clears throat> i can't really complain too much but um but yeah let's go right into his head so he can looks like he can go he can go this high that 
he can can I could break his neck if I wanted to. Um, I'm not gonna do that to be honest. Um, it's a little bit stiff. Um, let's see how his arms go. Oh, I felt the multi joint there. Um, do you guys hear that? It clicks right there. Oh, so he, he so it's good. He has like a multi joint here that kind of clicks, so you can go up. Um, so it's not loose like a ball. Um, if it was loose like a ball, I feel like I could just break this, but it, I can't. So see, oh, there you heard the snap there. Um, it is good because if you see here, they have they kind of built something in between here. Um, <clears throat> so that's kind of cool. Um, see, that's kind of cool that I can do that with his arms that has a multi-joint there. Um, we know his hands can come out because I can switch them for battle action. Um, I can bend him this. Oh, oh, snap. His body. You guys see that? His body. Oh, snap. Look at that. Look at that. I'm about to make him twerk real quick. Uh, look at him. Twerk for him. Body yada 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 yada. Sorry, <laughs> but that's kind of cool. His body, his body also has a multi joint here too, which it's kind of nasty. But um, it is Spider Man, so we we can twist his legs here. Um, which is oh oh, it's a little bit stiff. But after a while, there you go. It was stiff. Um. Again, we have a multi-joint here in his knees. His leg, his knees can go up that high. Oop, let's see how far his legs can go. Oh, we can make Spider-Man do the split, which is cool and nice. Because um, don't forget, Spider-Man is, or er, he, he is, oh, there we go. His, his feet, his feet, they don't have a joint here, so his feet can't can't he can't bend his feet um i guess that's a negative but overall very flexible i mean i'm liking the multi-joints it's not um <clears throat> i feel like the multi-joints help in this scenario um because i think the multi-joints help in this in this instance because it feels like it won't break easily um Let's see if I can change his, his, his hands. Oh, so there goes his hands. Oh, wait, nope. I put the wrong hand. There we go. There goes one hand. Let's see if we can get the other hand. Pretty stiff, which I don't mind because, again... I don't want them to break. So, yeah, let me get Spider-Man in all these poses, articulation-wise, and setting him up is pretty pretty easy. I'm not gonna lie, I like that compared to a lot of the Star Wars Black Series figures where I had a harder time to put this in in different poses. But yeah, let me let me get him in different poses, and yeah, guys, definitely for my first Spider-Man, definitely like it.
I'm thankful that you guys got to tune in, watch Spider-Man twirl around in his little uh, <laughs> suit. Um, thank you for tuning in. I'm thankful that you guys got to see the, the black suit Spider-Man from No Way Home. Uh, tell me what you think about it. I'm, I'm happy that I have it in my collection. I hope that you guys are happy. Um, it is a Build-A-Figure, so, you know, there's a lot more to it than just that one. Um, but I can't be mad. It's my first Spider-Man, uh, Marvel Legends. And, you know, it was only 22 bucks, so I really can't complain. Um, I'm definitely hoping to get a Figure Arts one, a, a Bandai Spider-Man, hopefully, in the future. But for my first Spider-Man, um, I can't complain. So tell me what you guys think in the comments below. And don't forget, guys, to subscribe. Because next week, we're tackling another Spider-Man. So tune in. All right, guys.